here at TVW, we like to check in and support local entrepreneurs, local businesses, many of them, of course, with temporarily closed doors during the COVID-19 crisis. We're checking in with one of our good friends. We've got Jason here from University Coin and Jewelry. It is such a pleasure to see you today. Hi, Jessa. I miss you. We miss you. This is a different way of communicating and you know this is how we have to do it right now uh, but uh, hopefully we'll get back to life as we know it uh, pretty soon here. I do want to share with our viewers because a lot of folks at home uh, viewership is up in case they haven't heard about University Coin and Jewelry give us a little overview about what you do. Sure uh, we're a resale shop uh, we buy diamonds gold silver you know, anything that, you know, you would have in the house. So, you know, we buy, sell and trade. And from there, we're looking forward to seeing our customers again on May 1st. And that's our hopeful date. And, you know, from there, give us a call. Uh, I'm at the store, you know, here and there. And we have an eBay shop, so eBay is really kind of going on right now since all of us are locked into our houses. Yeah, so folks are, you know, at home and it's we've talked about this in the past, oddly enough, it is a good time to buy and sell jewelry for folks who are out there looking to buy. They can shop on eBay and they can specifically shop your store, support your store. Yes, yeah, uh, universitycoinandjewelrystore.com and it's our eBay shop. But, uh, you know, everybody's going to be kind of out of the house on May 1st. So come and see us. We would like to see you, especially you, Jessa. So, yeah. yeah, and, you know, we were talking a little bit on the break. We actually discussed quite a bit before, before we started filming here today. Uh, a lot of folks aren't, pre aren't working right now. There are a lot of people out there that are still out on the front lines. Yeah, and it's, you know, myself included, um, I work two, three, four days a week, and it depends on, you know, what's going on. Um, but, you know, I really appreciate all the people that are out there on the front lines. You know, my post office guy, you know, Dustin, he's a really good friend of mine. And, you know, he's touching everything and, you know, he's delivered me packages. And I think that's awesome. And the same with the, you know, people that I, you know, appreciate in the health office. Um, you know, my friend Amber, uh, my friend Tim's wife, uh, Katie, you know, she touches babies every day. She's in the birthing unit. So those people are amazing to, to me. You know, I'm holed up in my house with my cats and it is what it is. But, uh, you know, those people, especially, you know, I think very highly of them. Yeah, as as do I. I totally respect you know your opinion there and your viewpoint. There's folks that uh, that need to be out working, and we as a society are reliant on those essential businesses. On the flip side, of course, those who have been deemed non-essential are going through some struggles as well. They've got employees that are probably at home and things of that nature trying to get creative. So we're looking forward to that date where they, these entrepreneurs that are really the fabric of our community can get back to what they do so well. That being said, on the break, you know, you said this is just a moment in time. Yeah, it's just a moment in our lives and May 1st is not that far away. You know, like I said, you know, I'm filling out paperwork to, you know, Give my employees some incentives and some money and you know um it's a moment in our lives yeah and if you know as an entrepreneur who is currently practicing safer at home what's a message before we had to break here that you'd like to share with some of our viewers who might be in the same boat uh that's a good one uh you know just i guess for me trust in god and from there, um, you know, do your due diligence, wash your hands, stay at home. And, you know, it's only a month, two in our lives. And share, I would like you to share that as we come into university coin and jewelry. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. 
I think a good way to head to break is share with folks what you held up for me before we started our interview. Yeah. There you so go. So stay, stay positive. Thank you. To me, that's the biggest thing is stay positive and this will pass and our lives will go on and come and see us when you need some money. <laughs> Sounds good. Jason, buying and selling jewelry at University Coin and Jewelry. You can shop them online. Thanks for sharing a little bit about what you have going on. We appreciate you. Thanks, Jessa. You bet. We'll be back with more after the break. <laughs>